In this work, we present the Leonard Jones layer for point cloud distribution normalization. Point clouds are an important representation of complex 3D shapes. Learning based point cloud generation and denoising models often lead to point clouds with poor distributions. They contain holes and clusters, leading to an inefficient use of the limited number of points without contributing additional information to the result. Our work focuses on distribution normalization of point clouds in these tasks. We systematically rearrange the points in order to equalize the density across the underlying surface without changing its overall shape. The Leonard Jones potential describes repulsive and weakly attractive interactions between atoms or molecules. We aim for a transformation from the initial distribution into a blue noise type arrangement by simulating the temporal evolution of the associated dynamical system. In each time step, the point cloud is decomposed into a new set of independent subsystems, each containing a single pair of particles, by finding the nearest neighbor of each point. As we also include dissipation in our system, the point configuration of the particle system will eventually stabilize and form a randomized uniform point distribution after a sufficient number of iterations. The sigma value is an important parameter of the LGL. For an appropriate value, the final distribution is uniform and does not exceed the initial boundary too much. LGL subsystems that consider more than one nearest neighbor typically do not converge, so that they are unable to achieve a uniform point distribution. We also find that the attraction term of the potential function is vital for the overall control of the final distribution. We also apply LGL to distribution normalization of points on 3D surfaces. Here, we first generate random points on a unit sphere by projecting random samples of the surrounding cube onto its surface. The resulting clusters and holes are then removed by applying LGL. We can automatically select suitable LGL parameters that result in good distributions for a given number of points. LGL also works on more complex mesh surfaces, as shown here. The main application of LGL is, however, its embedding in the generation loop of generative point cloud networks. By embedding LGLs into well-trained architectures, we are able to significantly improve their results with respect to the resulting point distribution, while at the same time only introducing minimal distortion of the underlying shape. We also don't require resource and time-intensive retraining of these models, as LGLs are solely embedded in the inference loop. Here, we show results of LGL-optimized generated point clouds with different numbers of points. We emphasize on generation tasks that use as few points as possible. Using LGL, we can extend the expressiveness of generation results for fewer points. Similarly, the LGL can also be applied to score-based point cloud denoising networks. The denoising process will iteratively update each point's position in order to move it closer to the predicted surface. Again, embedding the LGL in the denoising loop can improve the point distributions without introducing extra distortion. Thanks for watching.